taking an attempt at carving a baseball bat. All I've done is sanded the logo off. Got it on Amazon. I think it was like 20 bucks, 25 bucks. Making it as a surprise gift for one of my friends, very close friends. So, <clears throat> so far I have designed up the logo. I have a one and a quarter by eight inches. And I have it just uh, clearing out the whole pocket. And it's kind of like the uh, other videos where you've seen me do the uh, stacked text. So I have the text in there telling the text to carve at zero inches. And I have the uh, one and a quarter by eight inch uh, pocket cut set to carve at between an eighth and a quarter. So, obviously with the bat being rounded, what I've done is I've found my zero point, which I wanted to be here, and I zeroed it there, and then I moved it over to the highest port part of the bat, and um, started to lower my Z down. I always count my clicks if you've seen other videos. Um, I'll zero and get it close to the height, and then I'll move it over to the highest spot, and I'll start moving the Z down one click at a time, and I'll count. And then when I get to the surface of the wood with the paper, um, I'll return it back to zero, and then I'll go down that amount of clicks I've done. Um, yeah, so let's fire the machine up and uh, see what it does. All right, so after uh, I let it cut for just a little bit, you can see it started to carve the M. But obviously, um, I didn't account for the fact that the bat also slopes down this way. So I stopped the cut, and what I did was I removed the word. And I'm just going to do a pocket cut for that uh, one and a quarter by eight inches. I'm just going to try to flatten this area, and um, I'll speed the cut up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to carve it, let it stop, I'll re-zero it, carve it again. I'm going to try to get a nice flat area. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to carve the name into it. Um, or after it's flat, I'm not sure, I'll see what it looks like after it's done. So, stay tuned. So I've uh, hit this thing, I think, five times now. It's pretty flat. I'm going to have to hit this with my sander. So um, it's kind of hard to find center on a bat. So I think the next time I do this, I'm just going to hit the bat with my sander and just flatten it out the best I can first. But... Uh, not too bad. I mean, it cut pretty clean, but we'll see. Alright, so <clears throat> just need some sanding. Letters came out real nice. So I'm gonna have to hit this side with the sander. 
Same thing with the nose of it. And I'm going to paint it up. See how it turns out. Not too bad though. Definitely learned some things from this. Definitely learned to flatten your bat first so you don't waste an hour trying to flatten it. And then your carve should go perfect, honestly. So, thanks for watching. Till next time.